Hey guys, today we're talking suspension and uh, I was in a lot of these truck camper groups and uh, a lot of guys were recommending sumo springs and I never heard of sumo springs before and so I did a little little bit of research, just a little bit and they all looked good, no one was complaining about them at all. So uh, I went and did a search, I found they were on Amazon and they're a shitload cheaper than getting airbags because I'd originally thought I was going to get airbags for the for the truck and uh, so people go no 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 these, these are just as good as airbags and doing some research they, they call them the airless airbag so uh so i went and bought them i went on amazon click purchase they're at, at my doorstep a couple of weeks later absolutely loved it probably in the states you'd probably get it next day but i don't have that luxury in australia and um yeah so i'll show you what happened okay this happened <laughs> right this happened okay so so this here what, what happened was the, the, the plate under the bump stop, well, where, where the bump stop goes, it kept on hitting directly on that and it ended up cutting it like a fair bit. It was wearing, it wasn't ended up doing the anything in the end. And this one over here, you can see, it was starting to go too. So I was kind of a little bit pissed off because to be honest, I'd only run the truck camper a couple of times and I'd done a few loads of wood. Uh, so there really wasn't that much ongoing pressure onto these things for for this kind of wear uh, it'd be different if it was like the camper was on there all the time or something but that wasn't the case so yeah so I was, I was a little bit pissed off i took some photos and i went on to uh to super springs international's website and i said guys what the fuck and they immediately replied and said um yes yeah, sorry mate um you bought the wrong ones okay so <laughs> what i was meant to get are these Okay, so what what the deal is is that they they just said straight away, no, that's okay. Uh, we'll just ship you some new ones, and they didn't even ask for a delivery fee or anything. They just said, nah, we'll take care of it. All done, and it arrived the other day. And yeah, like I haven't installed it yet. I'm probably going to do it tonight or or tomorrow morning. And yeah, so pretty much this here, this plate. We'll try and have a look underneath. Which way does it go? So it goes that way. So you mount that just above, like the, the, the part that was wearing that part. So this will sit on there and it'll absorb all of the pressure. Okay, so it makes sense that that's, that's the way it's gonna be. And yeah, so I'll, I'll install that. But uh, yeah, guys, I just thought I'd give you guys a quick uh, lesson. The best way to learn is by watching someone else's mistakes instead of doing them yourself. Uh, I tend to always learn the hard way, but if there's anyone out there doing research on sumo springs, you might come across this video and go, oh, fuck. Okay, let's just make sure we're getting the exact right um, model for my truck. Okay, because apparently the F-250 two-wheel drive has a different bump stop plate underneath than the four-wheel drive. So, because I think that'll work on the two-wheel drive, I don't know. <laughs> But um, yeah, they said, this is the four wheel drive one. And uh, yeah, so guys, seriously, big shout out. Super Springs International, they, um, I, I didn't even register for the warranty. That's the, the thing I thought, oh fuck, I never like registered for the warranty. I just said, look guys, I bought these on Amazon a couple of months ago and this is the result. And they just said straight away, done, fixed, go about your way. So huge shout out to those guys. I recommend you guys well, if, if your local your local supplier gets them, go and support your local supplier. Else, hit up Amazon and and go on there and check it out. So, yeah, that's my shout out for the day. So yeah, right. guys, don't do the dumb thing. Do do some proper research. Get the right stuff for your own truck. And um, while you while you're going to order your own Super Springs, just before you do that, hit subscribe. Um, occasionally, I'm going to be dropping. A few different videos sometimes you might learn from it sometimes you might laugh and go fuck you're an idiot but uh anyway hope you guys enjoyed this one and learned something and maybe saved yourself some time and money guys have a good one guys you're awesome